Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today we're gonna be opening Stitch Fix boxes again. We just got the new month in, so we're gonna open them again and go through it one more time with y'all, show you what all we got, show you what all we keep, uh, how much everything costs, and uh, we'll just go from there, okay? So the first thing I got was this olive green purse. And I don't know, do you think it's real leather? Mm. I don't know, my dad could be able to tell. How much oh. does it cost? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, look at the inside. I don't know if you can see that. But it's like, so it's folded this way, and it has like a little, it looks like a zipper at the bottom, which is actually really cute, if you can see that. And then you open it, and then up here at the top is another little section. And then there's one here. Oh my gosh, there's so many pockets. It's so cute. And then it has a long strap, but I'm not going to take it off because I don't know if I'm keeping it or not. But the brand is Moda Lux. So if y'all want to check that out. It's actually really cute. I like that. I feel like I have this shirt already. I feel like I have this shirt. You have the Adjust My Altitude shirt. And it's like the same color, it's isn't it? It's the same color, yeah. And it's like the same material. Oh, you know what? I think it's actually the same I think same it's the same color. I think it's the same brand. Yeah. So it's literally just the same shirt from last time, but with, got a, pocket with a pocket. And it's the same color, same brand, same material. I kept oh, the last yeah. one, so I don't know if I'll keep this one. What's the brand? <clears throat> Threads for Thought. Threads for Thought. It's really nice, though. I mean... If nothing else, I might. We'll see. I like that. I like it's it. Really soft. Okay, so I'm gonna open my bundle. They come in boxes, but we already opened the box. The just box to make it easier. Just to make it easier. So last time, oh look, it's starts for thoughts too. I wonder if we had the same person. I don't know. I or think if you can use the same brand. I don't know. We'll check it. But I got a green shirt last time. This one's a little thicker. It is a Typical v-neck. It's a little wrinkly, but it's still cute. It's a knot in the front, which I know you can't really tell But it is knotted in the front. So it's kind of low in the front and longer in the back I think it's cute, but I like Depending it. on how much it is because oh, it's is really just like a typical like t-shirt It's not softer than a normal shirt. It's not thicker. It's not Anything really special about it. So we'll see how much this is Kind of depends on what all we like and yeah. if it's like for me flannels i like flannels but the flannels that they send me are so expensive i could just go get a flannel and it's cheaper so generally we don't you know i mean it's one if it's one that we really like or something that we really like we might keep it but generally because a lot of this stuff you can get cheaper but a lot of it you can't so i mean it really just depends on how much we like it on if we go ahead and get it or not we're not rich so <laughs> gotta budget a little bit do you want to tell them prices individually or you want to do it at the end? Uh, I don't know where my thing is. We can do it at the end. Well, no, let's go ahead and do it now. Yeah, let's go ahead and just like keep a running total basically. Does that yeah, make sense? Okay. So my green purse is $48 and then the green shirt, the v-neck green shirt is $38. So the blue shirt is the same as the other shirt is $34. And the shirt that I'm fixing to show you is 48. And it, I, I'm pretty sure this is like a flannel. It doesn't feel like a flannel though. But Who is it by? Red Ale? Yeah, Red Ale. I mean, it's nice. It's just not, it's not like a... It's not you a You know super... like how American Eagle has like the boyfriend, like for girls they have the boyfriend cut or style or whatever flannels and it's like super soft this isn't it kind of feels like a dress shirt yeah it like really a does. white dress which shirt. makes me kind of not want it kind of not want it because i mean i don't really like the way dress shirts feel so flannels are supposed to be soft yeah i like them soft they're nice and comfortable so that's probably a note next thing that i have here i'll tell you what it's called is a Lottie knit crop jumpsuit and it is $74. They got a jumpsuit? Yeah, so it's like a romper, but it's, uh, you know. Okay, let's figure this out. That's it. It goes this way and it's no, like. No, it's like a jumpsuit. Not like a romper. It's like a jumpsuit. Honey, a jumpsuit is a romper. Okay, baby. What's the difference? You mean a romper is a jumpsuit? 
Yeah, it's the same thing. Yeah, okay. Continue. Anyway, <laughs> this is like a spaghetti strap. It has like a slit in the front and it is honestly pretty short. Like it looks like it would probably come like right below my knee. So it's not really like long. The pattern, it is navy, which you can actually tell better on the camera that it is navy. And it has pink floral on it. I don't know about this. I'm not gonna lie, I like it. I don't think she will wear it. it oh, and it has pockets. It has pockets. I don't guys. think she'll wear it, but I like it. I think that the only thing that would make me not wear it is I don't really care for like mid-length kind of like pants I guess like you know like how mom jeans are how they kind of like they're a little bit below your knee but like not right at your ankle they're a little bit shorter I don't really care for those and with me being short maybe it comes down longer I don't know but I don't really I don't it, it looks pretty short and honestly it's pretty see-through is it we're gonna try we're gonna try all of it on even if we don't think we're gonna keep it so we can try it on and see how it looks I mean, it's cute, but it's $74. Like I said, I really don't think she'll wear it. Even if I like it, I don't think she'll wear it. So, the next thing that I have is a Threads for Thought. Another Threads for Thought. Yeah, Breton One Quarter Zip Hoodie. Is it a hoodie? Most of these aren't hoodies. Most of these are, like, no, just like a pullover. Oh, it you is got, a hoodie. You got a lot of the same brand. It is a hoodie. That's actually really nice. Oh, and the jumpsuit was by Wisp. It's called Wisp. I actually feel this. Oh, that's soft. That's it's really soft cool. and it's feel how thick it is. Oh my gosh. It's like that's a, like every other hoodie I've gotten has been like a really thin, kind of don't wear it if it's cold, kind of where if it's chilly and you just want to look good, basically. This one's like actually thick enough that you could wear it. And it's kind of, and I like it. I do like it. How I have another hoodie that stretched for thought. I think my pink one is. I'll have to get the pink one. It's not pink. Okay, it's like red, but it's, it's pink. It's like... It's pink. Whatever. This is... You have my thing? No. You have it right here. This is $58. $8. So it's a little expensive. But you know, I might only keep this. This might be the only thing I keep. So, you know, we'll see. Might be worth it. Okay, my next thing is... A, it's by Pink Clover and it is a, a cut off what it's called but anyways it is a sweater and it oh my god it's so thick um, they're like no it's cold and they're just sending us yeah, the they know it's cold but it's fixing to start getting warm again um, it kind of well I guess not I was gonna say it's cropped but it's not oh and look the bottom of it I don't know if y'all can see this hold this up with me on the bottom of it, it's not straight like across, which is actually really cute. Like How that. much is this? The sweater is forty-four dollars for this, and it's really soft. It's kind of, I guess, it's kind of like a burnt orange color. What does it say? What color does it say? Burnt orange. Oh, I read the wrong one then. Yeah, I read the wrong one. It is a lily crop scallop hem pullover. Mm. I mean, it's cute. My bad. Sorry. It's not pink clover. So, my next one is Coleman Bedford Cord mm. Cord Trucker Jacket. It's a trucker jacket. Uh, it is $74 and it is olive. So, $74 tells me I'm probably not keeping it. Um, Looking at it, I'm probably not keeping it either. It's not its not that it's like not a nice jacket, because it is, but I don't like these. I don't like straight button jackets. I want a jacket that I can zip up. I'm, I don't know. I just don't like it. I don't like it when they're like that. Are you like it to have like, even if it was like this, you'd like it to have a zipper? Yeah, like, I'd like if it had like a zipper on the inside and you could zip it and then button them, that'd be fine. But I feel like when I wear these, if I try to wear them when they're cold, when it's cold out, then a lot of air gets through and I get cold. And if I try to wear it when it's like chilly but not cold, then I get hot because it's still a decent heavy jacket, but it just lets too much air in when it's cold and I get cold. So I really don't like these. 
I like the jacket. I just don't. If it had a zipper, I'd it consider it. It is a really nice jacket. If it had a zipper, I'd consider it. But I don't think that without. I don't think with just the buttons that I'm going to keep it. Uh, I'll try it on, but I doubt it. Also, I don't know what you would like really wear it with. Yeah. Again. Again, all the. I don't have really have anything for that. Yeah. Uh, and it's seventy four dollars. Like it's yeah. A little <laughs> overpriced. Pretty expensive. Typically, when I buy a jacket, which basically for the both of us we buy a lot of hoodies which i think a lot of people do more so than like jackets like that or even like designer jackets you know that aren't hoodies and those typically cost like 30 dollars so like that's, not bad. that's kind of what you know you really want to spend on a jacket i mean i do have a jacket that was from the gap and it was like a hundred and something dollar jacket but i got it at tj maxx so you know i did good there Right, what do you got right. there? Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Now this is the pink clover. Oh, this is yours. I was so confused. The pink clover waffle knit, whatever. It's $44 and it is a hoodie. And it has the neck that's, you know, it scrunches up. It's not really a hood. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. It's just like this. Do you like those? Yeah. I like, I I like this. One. It is see-through, but I mean, that's not really a bad thing. And it's three-toned, which I don't know how I feel about that. Because I'm very one color, two color kind of. Like, yeah. I don't like sleeves being one color, bottom being another color, and top being another color. That's just not really my thing. But it is really cute, and it is really soft. But it's not one of those things that you would wear and be warm. Like, I think you would put this under, like, that thick jacket that I got from TJ Maxx. Yeah. Probably. I don't know. I could be wrong. And like I said, this is not a hood. Which I don't really wear hoods, but still. I don't know. It's cute. Hey. But so it's $44, yeah, honey. $44. For this. <laughs> My very last thing is a Rye Slim Fit jeans. And they're supposedly indigo, which I'm a guy. They're blue. They're dark blue. Indigo. They're like a dark blue. Like a really dark blue. How much are they? 74 you said? Or These are sixty-eight dollars. Sixty-eight. Which honestly is expensive, but it's when you think jeans, that's it's really not. Like my not really the jeans soft. the jeans that I have on now were like fifty dollars. So sixty-eight is really not that bad. Um It says they have been specially dyed. This is them. They like I said, they're kind of just like a dark blue. It says indigo, but oh my gosh. They're so not they're, as soft as the they're just blue. Are. And they kind of have, which I don't really think you can tell on camera. This, like the wash on it is kind of yellow. It's not like most jeans, how most jeans have like a white kind of lighter blue kind of color. This is yellow. Yeah. Um, I actually kind of like them though, to be honest. They might not be that comfortable, so I'm going to try them on and see. They might be like really straight cut though. But for $68, they are a little more than what I would normally spend. Um, but we'll see. Like I said, I'm going to try everything on and we'll go from there. If we like it, we'll keep it. And if not, we won't. Yeah. Well, uh, we'll show y'all what we keep and we'll be right back, okay? On the, um, on your thing, it tells you on here that your total, if you bought everything that I got, it would be $248, but they take out a 25% discount, so that would be $62. And so if you bought everything, oh, so on top of the 25% off, it actually also takes off a $20. Could you try again? Okay, Siri, nobody was talking to you. You can shut up. How can I help? Shut up. Anyways. Minor in minor altercation with Siri, don't worry about it. Um, so it takes off the 62, which is 25%, and then it also takes off your styling fee, which is $20. So if I bought the entire box, instead of it being $248, it would be $166. Um, and for me, this is like the one time hers has been more expensive off the jump. Um, so nope, never mind. Yours is more than Mine is 282, with 25% discount, takes $70 off. Drops it to two eleven fifty, and then another twenty dollars off for the styling fee. So for my whole box, it would be one ninety one fifty, which I yeah, think I'm we've. I'm pretty sure that's the first time yours has ever been more than mine. 
Really? Yeah. I thought mine was always been more. Because I always get like a $100 jacket. Yeah, but still, like, they send you shirts that are like $30 or whatever. Yeah. So. Like, I have a $34 Like, shirt. I'm pretty sure 166 is the cheapest. It might be. Mine's ever been. I could be wrong. I don't know. Um, I know in the last video we did, we kind of didn't tell you that. But when you do sign up for it, it tells you that they charge you the $20 a month. But the good thing about it is the $20 comes off. I mean, so more or less, if I, it kind of comes off. If I only got the $34 shirt, it would only be $14. Yeah. Because they're going to knock the 20 off. Right. So no matter what you buy, they not whether it's off. one thing or you now, know, if you don't get anything, then they keep your money and that's just I don't know if they do or not. We haven't we haven't ever not I'm pretty sure they do anything. I'm pretty sure they don't like refund you or put it towards the next one. Because it's a well, fee for the you, person to, you, to do it. If you don't have if you get absolutely like if you get something if you, i'm gonna get this out eventually if you get a box and it doesn't have anything at all that you like or want to keep in it and you send it back they will tell you that if you want them to send you another box by like monday they will they'll send you another box but if you're like no i just want a different stylist send me one next month then they can do that too but like he said i don't know um if they credit you back the twenty dollars or if they don't why are you doing that stop it okay anyways we're gonna try everything on and then we'll tell you everything that we keep and what we don't keep so we'll be right back we'll be right back see you i don't know if this is where um the camera was placed like in the last part that we filmed but the tripod like where the camera goes it's kind of like loose so it's kind of wobbling all over the place but anyways we're gonna show you what we're keeping how much um, it cost we already bagged up everything that we're returning we already paid for everything um so we're just gonna show you what we're keeping what he's keeping what i'm keeping go ahead and i'm keeping the hoodie that i was making fun of naturally she put it on and decided she really liked it. Yeah, because I like the way it fits. Um, I don't know. I, I think it's soft. I like the way it fits. I haven't really been able to find hoodies that I like like the way they fit. Because, I don't know. I feel like I'm oddly sized, I guess. Because like when I buy hoodies, if it's an extra small, it's like too short and the sleeves are too short. But if I buy a small, then it makes me look bigger than I am even though it's really small but anyways so I'm keeping the hoodie it was $44 and then I am keeping the generic shirt that I also made fun of because I don't have that many like regular just like plain t-shirts and when you put it on which maybe you can be able to tell but the knot that's in it is on the side it's not in the front and then on the sides which you can't really tell unless you put it on. But the sides, like, it, it, like, I don't know. Comes Taylor's? Yeah. Taylor's, I guess? I don't know. But it's really, it's really cute on. Like, I like the way it fits and it's comfortable and it'd be cute with, like, leggings or jeans or whatever, whatever really. So I like it. And then the only thing. Oh, this was $38. Sorry. If so I'm my total was $70. 70. Yeah. And the only thing that I'm keeping was the one quarter zip up hoodie. Can you believe that? It's the only thing that I'm keeping. The reason I'm not keeping the shirt is it's not the same color. I found the other one. It's not the same color as the other one. The other one's but like it's, a more greeny yeah, kind of. That one's more color. like gray blue. The other one's more like green gray. I don't know. It's weird. But it's the exact same style just with a pattern on the back. Did you check to see if it's the same company? It is. Oh. Um, so it's like the exact same and I already have a ton of long sleeves. I'm wearing a long sleeve now. So it's just like there's really no point. He has a lot of like long sleeves that are like blue, but also they don't have anything on them. Yeah, like this one. Like I got this I got this sleeve. I got this long sleeve from Stitch Fix. Yeah. Like a month ago. Yeah, we, we didn't film like three months ago. Before we, we started film filming. Yeah. So This I mean, is our fifth? Fifth Stitch Fix box. Yeah, so I mean, we, we've had other ones, so I already have a couple things. Like I said, I already have a bunch of long sleeves. 
So there's really, there was really no point in me keeping it. I'm keeping this just because of how soft it is. I like the color and I like that it's thick. It's really nice. And I really don't have anything that's like, it's, it, I know this is stupid, but I don't have anything that's like a quarter zip up and a hoodie. I have one quarter zip ups and I have hoodies, but I don't have anything that's like both like this is. Yeah. So I'm going to keep this and I've tried it's this not, on and I really like this. It's not too tight. It's not yeah. too loose. It, so it, it really fits it. perfect. Yeah. Um, all right, guys, that's going to be it for this time. I was going to say something about it. I'm sure we'll film, if she says it, we'll film it. Probably not, who knows. How but, much was yours? Uh, 40, this was 58. The total price was what, 44? No, 43. 43. So, you know, with tax, it's 58 plus tax. Oh, I remember now. Um, I was gonna say that we've never gotten shoes. He's never gotten like accessories. Like I said this in the last video, you can get cufflinks and watches and stuff like that. They even have like men's bracelets, which he actually has wanted in the past and he hasn't ever gotten them. And they also do men's shoes, whether they're just dress shoes or sneakers. And they do shoes for girls too, which are like heels and like any type of shoe basically. And so for our next box, I'm sure you would like like some accessories or like at least shoes. I would love to have a pair of shoes. Yeah, and or, I, or a bracelet or something. They like also that. do workout like clothing. Like so for girls they'll send you like sports bra and leggings that like match, like from Fabletics, which I would love. Like even though I don't work out, like not yet, not my yet. But my you know. Um I'd like to get shoes. I have gotten a purse twice now yeah, and jewelry once. And my best friend also signed up from for Stitch Fix, and on her first box, she got a pair of heels. Like they were, like ankle boots, and they were so cute. And now I want shoes. <laughs> like I, I, I don't know. I like ankle boots, and so I'd like to have some. But I think you can like put on there that you're looking for that stuff. Yeah, because last time, like every box that we got, we were getting pants like jeans and they were kind of like every pair of jeans was like the same and we would put on there no these are too expensive like whatever and then get some and they'd be like ten dollars more yeah like every time it was like getting more expensive and so we finally just put on there um it asks you like is there before they send your box it says are you interested in telling your stylist anything that you're looking for or whatever and we've never done that until probably the last time the, the last time was when we did this and i put on there we're not looking for jeans like you know whatever and i got leggings and i don't even think you got pants last time yeah oh, got you got those pants. joggers yeah so um you know you can do that i guess we'll we'll put in some suggestions saying that he wants accessories and shoes and i want shoes and see if they actually listen and send us shoes. I don't know. I guess we'll see. We'll let you know. Uh, be looking out for another one of these videos. Probably in about a month from now. Yeah. We just got my box today. This is going to go live tomorrow on the 27th. Yeah. So this today's the 26th. We just got my box today. So expect another Stitch Fix video about the same time next month. Sometimes they come in a little early. They generally mine like, always comes in early. Yeah, hers like, I always, got mine last week. We either get them at the same time or she gets hers first. I don't ever get mine first. Yeah. Um, it said though when we checked out that our next fix should be coming like March 25th. Um, you know, you can you can go on there and tell them, hey, I want to skip a box this month or you know, however many you want a year, you can cancel it. Like this, it's not permanent, of course. Um, we just enjoy doing it, so yeah. we keep doing it. Whether or not we keep something every time, it's still something fun because, like, you get something in the mail and you're like, "Oh, I really like this," and so know, like having even, something to open, I guess, is fun. Even this time, like, I only kept one thing. She only kept two, and you get what five? Gen yeah. Generally, generally you get five. five things. The first box we had, I think I kept four, and you kept four. Mm -mm, I only kept a shirt. From the first box? Yeah, because Okay, then I kept me. four and then she kept you kept four the next time. You've kept four. I've kept one of the first couple times. A few things. But like the more that we've done it, the like the less we've kept out of the box. Because we realized like In the beginning it's it really, was just excitement. Yeah, like right now we're at the point now that it's okay, we're only gonna keep what we really, really like because yeah. you're always gonna get something nice. You're always gonna get something you like. And you can't always keep everything you want. It just right. gets too expensive at that point. So 
It, we kind of cut back no, on what all yeah, we No, yeah, you're right. The first time I, I did keep two things. I kept two things. But they sent me a shirt that was like purple, kind of like fuchsia. And then they sent me the same exact shirt in like green, but it had like floral on it. it but it was the same exact shirt, like literally the same exact shirt. And so I was like, I'm just gonna keep one because I don't really have a lot of dress shirts. And I was like, this is a dress shirt, so we'll keep it. All right, that's it, isn't it? That's everything. That's if everything. y'all have any questions about Stitch Fix and you personally want to ask us, feel free to comment. Um, you can go on Stitch Fix. It you know tells you the whole process basically. Um, also, comment down below whether or not you like us doing these videos. If you you know if like you want to see another one next month, or if you don't, if you don't want to see one, then we won't do them. But um, it was our first video. And so we would kind of like to keep, keep the trend going of doing them every month. But if y'all aren't into it, then we won't do them. Yeah. Um, but definitely give Stitch Fix a try. Because yeah, it's definitely worth it. It's, it's definitely worth it. You know, we don't really shop much, I guess. Like, him mainly, a lot of his clothes come from, like, Christmas. So this is, like, something, like, if you don't like going out in public, but you also want to try something new, like a new style or something, this is a great way to do it because we have definitely gotten some stuff that we wouldn't personally pick out ourselves I think and kept it yeah and kept it so all right guys so that's gonna be it for this time so don't forget to like subscribe click on that bell get post notifications turned on we'll see you next time peace geese broskies <laughs>